Well, Officer Ram Ramnos? Ram Ramos? Didn't take long. He, I thought he was the taxi. <laughs> he's like, oh, no, policia. And he's dressed like in combat fatigues, but he did show me a badge and he's like, document? And I'm, okay, that must mean passport. He's like asking me all these questions. He's like, what are you doing here? Like, it's a small town. And he's filling all this stuff out on a card. He's filling out my, he takes my driver's license because he didn't have my address on the passport. And he's page 27. And he's like, he's like, this. He's like, I see you. I don't know you. A very small town. Uh, how long are you staying here? Where are you staying? What are you doing in town? I said, look, man, Donald Trump, man, Melania. And he smiles, you know. So finally, I mean, I'm home, you know. Um, so I was like, uh, well, how do I get a taxi? He's like, there's only one in the whole town. And he closed. He closes at 8. So it's five minutes of 8, you know. So the guy at the train station gets in and calls calls the taxi. And he's like, yeah, 10, 15 minute uh, taxi. It's like, wow. So uh, part two of this video is mostly over. I just would say that it didn't take long for the police to come and say that who's this goofball out here filming the sign that says Sevnika. Uh, you know, I don't know you. I see you. I not recognize you. And I want to find out what you're doing here. Wow. Man, we keep everything safe. I was like, yeah, you don't say, buddy. <laughs> I, I get that impression. So uh, we are in a ghost town. The last time I heard anybody speak English on the train, I'm talking over the loudspeaker. You never hear anybody talk English on the train, but I'm talking over the loudspeaker to give you a courtesy English translation. That stopped about five hours ago. After Ljubljana, I stopped seeing lights. I mean, you didn't even see a light out of the train. It went through pitch blackness for two hours. We drove through a village somewhere. I saw a couple of flickering torches a few miles away, uh, but it's dark. It's remote. It is home. For Chris Carpenter, the deplorable cowboy has arrived, and I'm going to raise hell, and Ramos and I are going to be intimately acquainted. I asked him if he found me drunk to pick me up, and he just laughed, and he said, have fun. So I have a feeling I'll be intimately acquainted with the man uh, when he's off duty, because there's only one or two bars in town, I would assume, and I'll find him at it. And he's out walking the beat. It's pretty boring for a train station. Say lovey.